What's up, everybody? It's Nerp here, and I'm gonna play some Judgment today. I've had a lot of uh, ranked matches in a row videos, but I think I'll give ranked a little break. Well, not exactly a break, but I'm not gonna take it as like um, I'm not gonna go as like uh, I don't know, I'm just not trying as hard to rise in the ladder right now. It seems very hard right now. A lot of decks are pretty equal. I'm kind of stuck between 1800 and 1900. And it, I'm not having that much fun with it right now. So I'm going to play more, like, uh, have some more fun playing some, like, different kind of decks and ranked. And, yeah, stuff like that. Playing some Judgment and all that. So, you know, I, I'm sure I'll be one of the contenders for the top spot in the ladder once again. But for the time being, I'm not going to be vying for that spot. And I think I've already proven myself being like more one of the latter for a couple months, so I think I can take a little break from ranked. I might still play around ranked, but with different kind of decks. So we're gonna play some judgment. I haven't played judgment in a long time. Let's see. Uh, sudden eruption is cool, and so is Jarl Erhold. Down here, it's more like meh. Um, I guess we'll just take the sudden eruption. Or no. Hmm. I'm actually gonna take the Yarl because I feel like Sudden Eruption's I wonder if saying Sudden Eruption is good. <laughs> okay, um Plating I don't know. Uh draining mist, I guess. Now it's tough. All these new memorials are uh, interesting. Um, tick bomb, mangy. It's tough. Uh, crown, ragged. Oh, Witch Doctor and Corpus Collector is a nice combo. Yeah, I think I'll just go Witch Doctor. Uh, useless Contraption, Corpus Collector. Yeah, I'm not really liking this draft so far. Yeah, I'm definitely not loving this draft. Um, Binary Age or Echo Maton? I think I'll take the the echo. Ooh, that's a, this is a nice decay. If only these were on separate rows. But I would like a Damager's and a new random dispersal. I mean, obviously I wouldn't go energy and decay like that, but I think you kind of get what I'm saying. Okay, so I'll go for a wing soldier. I think we're actually in decay. I think I'm gonna take a damning curse. Yeah, and then I'll go Eager Scryer, another Corpus Collector, Mangy Rat, Bog Hound. Alright, I'm trying to make Decay work here. It's tough though. We're getting champions like crazy. Go for a Malevolent Gaze. There's two Malevolent Gazes there. Um, I don't know. Maybe I can splash Order. I'll take another Malevolent Gaze. Sorry, that's the phone. Um, I guess... I don't know. I'm really just... I might not be making the best picks here. Uh, Ripper... Um... And now I will take the... I don't know. It doesn't really matter here. I guess I'll just take the Berserker just because... Hex marks... Fellar Fatigue. I do have two Eager Shards. That's gonna be really cool. Reaping Mess is cool, but Reaping Mess isn't that good. Period. <laughs> Um, Animavore, hopefully I can draw a scavenger construct, and there's also this rod eater I can put it on, so it's like that. The Sir Sage is okay, two rod eaters is nice. I'm going to take the Eager Sir to have more, more synergy with my Pillar Fatigue. And I only have one Pillar Fatigue, it's not a big deal. Rod is just better. Um, ooh, Rumble, ooh, a road. Yeah, we want a road. Tribesmen. Blight is nice over suffering, but blight is better. Um, Alcabonk, I guess. You're nice. 
I think we got a pretty good deck now. Our deck wasn't so good a few moments ago, but now I think it's nice. Stitcher, another Eager Scryer over the Fester and Freak. I don't think Fester and Freak is that good. Iron Bile, Arthritis, oh. Tough choice is the end here. Let's see how many Decay cards I have. I have 27 Decay, so I can't go Mono Decay. This would give me Decay. Do I have a lot of energy? I have seven. I have, let's see what I have low cost in. I have energy cards, but they're generally high costed. Ash Runner. And I could go Dark Strike. Order, I don't think I'm in. I only have. I mean, I do have Crown of Strength. Fleetness. Warding Stone. Should I just take the Puppet Soldier or just take the Return to Nature? Because I do have some. Like on a road. Um. A road. And what else do I have from Growth? I just have. Ragged Wolf. Yeah, I'll just take the Return to Nature. Probably just the flat out best card, even if I don't get the growth. Okay. Um, let's add all these to the deck and see if we want to take anything out right away. Now, everything can stay in there for now. Now, I think a road is nice. A ragged wolf. Now, there's 30. I think that's going to be it. I mean, yeah. Probably won't even play a road or ragged wolf unless the return to nature gets a, gets a kill. So, all right. Decay growth. Let's see how this works. Will be my first judgment in a long time. Triple what I had before rebellion. That's like I had like a hundred, what, hundred thirty before rebellion. That would be um three hundred ninety thousand. One hundred thirty thousand. I meant times three. 90,000. So, Master Samurai, what does, what does he want to trade? Alright. Well, uh, yeah, I want, I'll, I'll turn it off. I'll whisper if he whispers me again while I left. Alright, so, um, we're going second, but we have a nice starting hand. I can go Mangy Rat, sack probably the Iron Bile, and go Rod Eater, Corpus Collector, Rod Eater, and something. Okay. Well, we could draw a new starting hand, but I think our starting hand is pretty good. I'll sack the Iron Bile for a rat. Now. Maybe that was a bad choice. Because now I can move down and kill my rat next turn if I don't draw a two drop. Or I could malevolent the keys. Hmm. You know what? I think I'm gonna malevolent gaze. This is probably not the best move. Because he's just gonna move away anyways. Or you could have like another ragged wolf. But I went for it. So there's that. Yeah. <laughs> it's almost like I just wasted a card. And he's killing it anyways. Well. Uh, that was exciting. Okay. So. This is just this curse one. Big deal. I guess it dies immediately to an infectious blight. Which is actually pretty useful. Immediate death to an infectious but Ooh, Rat King, ouch. How do I get rid of all those rats? Thought I had a good deck on my hands. Alright, uh, Pillar of Fatigue is gonna be really cool with the... Uh, where do I take Corpus? Oh, tough choice. I think I wanna keep the Pillar of Tape because I have like a bunch of Eager Strikes. Just play another Rod Eater, I guess. Uh, this is this is tough. I don't think I'll be able to win this game. That Rat King is really gonna be too much. Nothing to counter. 
Okay, he's moving away. As long as he doesn't have like crimson bowls or god hands, I should be able to live for a while and hopefully get some fatigue pillars and like eager scars going. And there's another rat king. So he can quickly spam rats, which I am not happy about. How am I going to kill those rats when I, I have one return to nature? Doesn't really do much. I need to get an infectious blight going immediately. Now, I think I'll sacrifice some level link gaze here. Or actually, I'll sacrifice the animal war. I mean, what am I going to use that for, anyways? I want more decay, even though I'm only going to play the pillar fatigue this turn. I feel like this is going to be the right play right now. Probably should put it in the back. These pillar fatigue, I think, is something that I'm going to want to protect. I know this guy's open to like veteraning or something but whatever all right so next turn i could play scryer possibly something else so i just hope he doesn't have a veteran here okay well if those guys only could attack for one every turn then i think i'm okay here and now Ooh, damn curse is nice Well, I guess there's no point in hiding up there, right? Like, I mean, the damage is not that worth it right now. I think I want to get into a position where I can more easily do stuff. And I'll start getting the card draw going. And I'll just keep sac- Ooh, Draining Mist. I gotta save that for when they're, like, all attacking. Hopefully I can get my infectious plate going soon because that's basically my only counter to all those rats, but still it's gonna go slowly. If he has like any kind of god hand or crystal in this deck, I am screwed. So let's hope he doesn't. And during the mist, maybe I'll use it next turn, but it would stop three rats from attacking. I don't know. I might have to get something in front of these idols because with the pillar of fatigue, it's not like you can move up. But attacking these three idols, they might fall down eventually. Don't have to worry about the god hand yet, but the crimson ball could be uh, pretty annoying. Oh, there's the sister of the bear, which I say fine. I mean, put it right in my path. Okay, so now could be time for a draining mist. I am going to disagree. I'm going to say it's time to go another Eager Scryer. And... Eviscerous Age. Or we could just start draining this. I don't know. I take a Damn Curse. I like, I like all these cards in my hand. I don't want to sack any of these. You know, I think Visitor Sage is the one I'm gonna have to sacrifice. I think I can do it for, uh... I mean, if he has a Crimson Bowl, like, he could, like, win so soon. You know, I'm just gonna take the bet. If he has a Crimson Bowl, he has a Crimson Bowl. I wanna keep the Pestle Simulator. I think I'm gonna actually sacrifice the... The Damning Curse. Crazy, I know. Okay, so now I'm going to move the U up. Put you there. Put you there. Move you back. That's a lot of cards, right? Okay, it's not like he has any structures, but. We're getting more resources now. We're starting to get all that card revenge from these two guys. Be really nice to get like a return to nature. I could always erode my own thing to get more decay, but probably won't be a good idea. Draining mist this coming turn, I think. Because that's when most of these guys are attacking. That's why I didn't play it last turn. I was thinking about damage cursing this brother last turn, but oh well. So he is moving. Okay, he's just gonna attack. It looks like. 
Okay, so I think we're at it first. We're gonna draining mist. I'm gonna decide what to do after. Uh, now. You know what? I think we should just play both of these guys. I think I should sacrifice the erode. Play the bog in it. Oh, he surrendered. I guess he's pretty. Pretty, uh. Upset after the draining mist. Alright, well, there's a win. I'll just continue playing these uh, judgment matches. So, uh, that'll be it for this video. Sorry, it's kind of short. But, yeah. So, thanks for watching. Like the video if you enjoyed. Uh, subscribe if you want more videos like this. And keep on surrounding, everybody. Thanks for watching.